So we'll be playing a SpongeBob game tonight. It is a game that came out on the Game Boy Color a while ago called SpongeBob Legend of the Lost Spatula. I played this game as a kid. I don't really have much recollection about it, but I'm going to play it anyway. Might have played like the first minute of it just to get a grasp on the forces I'm about to deal with. Gotta say, the, the colors look really pale because of the emulator I'm using. I'm not really using something like Visual Boy Advance. It's also a lot louder than I remember it being. Thank God I have limiters on voice meter, or else SpongeBob would have dominated the, the ears of the masses. But still, the colors look pretty pale on this because of the emulator I'm using. And again, not using Visual Boy Advance. Um, I'm using one of the built-in RetroArch core emulators because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just a total hipster. Yep, that's, that's our star of the show. SpongeBob SquarePants. Look out, SpongeBob. Uh, there's, um, statue. Mr. Krabs, I found a statue. It was very menacing. And for some reason, Mr. Krabs knows about it. It marks the entrance to the Dutchman's underworld. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. A long time ago in the city of Palm Bay, there was a master fry cook who ruled with the golden spatula. So, so there's this one spatula and a guy had it, and, and that was like, this guy was the monarch of the world. Look at all of this lore. <laughs> This is- this is one of the craziest backstories I've- I've ever skimmed over in my entire life. Press the A button to use items or accept, and press the B button to jump. Okay! Yeah! Great! That's- that's amazing. Spongebob can jump. Not like I played two other Spongebob games before, where he did the exact same thing. Oh, hi, Squidward. Looking as depressed as ever, but this time in 8-bit. So I gotta go over to Goo Lagoon. Go talk to Mrs. Puff. No, fuck Mrs. Puff. I have priorities. I'm on a mission. On, on, on a mission to, to, to open the gates to the underworld. And to cause a grease fire. Bubble bath! You gave me a wardrobe malfunction. Congratulations, Plankton. You went to college. Good for you, man. I went to college and did nothing with my life. Oh my god, what happened to Mr. Krabs? What's wrong with his, with his eyes? They're so small! What, did the Bikini Bottom government beat him up to send a message not to look for the golden spatula? Oh, oh, great. I think I'm about to get my account suspended. Nudity is not allowed! And, 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 and there it was. Poor Mermaid Man, look at what they did to him. 8-bit has not done any favors for you, my friend. Okay, yeah, I got a hull monitor uniform that I didn't ask for. I guess I can go to the beach and assert my newfound power and authority. Alright, so this is Goolagoon. This is the destination. Totally radical. I must say, I'm, 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 I'm feeling quite nostalgic. Gotta remember the controls. Uh, A is for attacking with bubbles. Also, I gotta remember, this is a Game Boy game. The controllers are gonna be a little crusty. So I must treat this very delicately. So, are there limited lives? There's no indicators of such, but, but then suddenly there's just gonna be a twist where it's like, Oh, nope, you do have limited lives! You screwed up! Get over here. Come back! I didn't have patience as a kid, and I don't have patience as an adult. Oh, it's a treasure chest. Yes! More pants! Let's go! Back to being the hall monitor! I found a spatula. Dude, nice. It's just that I, I don't know how to get to the spatula. I don't even know what a spatula does. If it was a kitchen, I'd have a much better understanding, but no, I'm, I'm, I'm just out in the skies of a beach right now. How do I switch to it? Oh great, there are passwords in this, meaning that I have to do this all in a single go, or, or, or else all my progress will be undone. Unless if I opt to abuse save states, which I am absolutely not above doing. Spongebob, stop dancing like an idiot. I'm trying to warn you of, of my power, of what would happen to those who would cross me. You, you getting ready to get vicious with me? I will load a save state. I will be untouchable, because I'll just simply reset that moment where you punched me. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but this- this platform right here looks very peculiar. A little inappropriate. I feel like there's, like, secret imagery in this game. The developers back in the early 2000s had the foresight that maybe one day there would be beings out there, simply known as content creators, and they would use their ability to record their gameplay. They also had the foresight to know that there would be- that the websites that would provide that content would have a low-tolerance policy on nudity or zero-tolerance policy, 
SpongeBob is just watching you, waiting for your channel to get banned. Why'd I jump there? That was- that was a bad decision. I found an anchor. Oh, awesome. And, and it took me over here. Oh, and it took me to exactly where I needed to be. There are four oven knobs needed to unlock the hidden statue. Am I just not allowed to cause pandemonium? I also heard that this game can take up a half an hour to beat. It's- it's really short, and the controls are really janky. So who knows, I- I- I have a strong feeling it's gonna be extended. Those scallops are incredibly dangerous. Very dangerous. Avoid them at all costs. They are the guardians. They, they are here to stop you from opening the Flying Dutchman's locker. Counteracting them is pretty much impossible. The SpongeBob's only attack option has an arch. Yes, I found pants. Old pants from the old days. I lost my pants. Uh, no, 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 go, go away, go away. There is no way to defeat them. Your only option is to run and scream and then be driven insane with just the sheer number of times you'll be killed by these things. I crouched in everything! You saw! You saw! Everybody saw! There were countless witnesses. I guess I'm just not allowed to have logic in video games. A portal. Yes, it'll bring me to safety or it will take me to a very dangerous place. Larry. No! <laughs> Why did you take me back here? I've met malicious beings before. No, no, I haven't. This is like really the first time. How is one supposed to increase their survival probabilities in a nightmare hellscape like this? Ah, 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 get to the portal! And 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 now just save state. Look at this guy just flexing his muscles. Why don't you come over here and get hit by my bubble? There you go. There you go. Hitting them only makes him angry! No, no, way. It, it makes him the opposite of angry. It, it, it makes them run away in terror. Wait a second, I, I was here before, right? But I was here with a different pair of pants. You know what's funny? Backtracking. What are, what are you looking at? Oh, oh, so you, you, are you upset because I'm, I'm out in public in my underwear? Spon Spongebob, stop bringing it around town. You're making the public uncomfortable with you. You do know that you're gonna get arrested for public indecency, right? There's no way around it. Just go to Jellyfish Fields, and, and for some reason, Bubble Bath is here. <laughs> Why is he there? <laughs> what, 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 what just happened? How did I suddenly just jump high in the sky? Oh, it was that weird flower-like thing. It, it, it gives me a, a nice old bounce. You do understand that I'm- that I'm doing this to open a gate to hell, right? Oh, nice, another portal. I will gladly go inside of it. Oh, yeah, of course. I- 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 I go through the portal. It says, April Fools. Look at me. I'm trapped. I wish this would stop happening. I don't know what I did to deserve this. I'm being bullied. By not just one bubble bath. I'm convinced that there's an entire army of bubble bath. Plankton cloned bubble bath hundreds of times. He created an entire army because he knows what's at stake. He knows exactly how dangerous SpongeBob's mission is, and he knows that it could very well risk the population of Bikini Bottom. So are you friendly or are you dangerous? Nope, you're you're friendly. Nope. You know what it's time for? I'm gonna equip an item. I can just throw Krabby Patties. And the moment the grease touches a person's skin, they will rue the day they crossed SpongeBob SquarePants. This is a well-seasoned burger. They are resistant. <gasps> no! Jellyfish are vegans! That was some really nice collision. Ah! No! I actually found a portal. Bubble Bass Clone 649. Your mission is to protect this portal at all costs, for it leads to one of the four hidden keys. If you see Spongebob, assault him. Even if he's defenseless and is only in his underwear, you will make him naked. You understand me, good sir. But then it turns out the portal is just a red herring. And it turns out it actually was. You clever son of a bitch. And it just takes me to the boss fight, alright. 
At least the checkpoints actually allow you to start at the boss fight itself. I would say in spades, this game was ahead of its time. One of the biggest innovations of that time, I would say. Now the fun part is actually trying to hit this thing. Actually, it's not that bad. He's trapped in a bubble. Now what? Oh, okay. I, I, that's how I get the key. Hi, Sandy. I'm madder than a cat in a bathtub. I lost my hat in the desert. You had a hat. Is it is it like a like a backup helmet or is it just one of those cowboy hats that are extremely massive that you just put on top of your uh, fish tank? Sorry, viewer. I'm I'm just based like that. Well, I'm sorry you get offended by every little thing I do. Man, why does everybody have to be a bunch of snowflakes? So what's up with the new bikini? Looking really good, man. SpongeBob. Found my shorts yet? No, Patrick, you're gonna wear that dress whether you like it or not. Oh, wait, it's a barrel. Are you implying that barrels can't be beautiful? You fucking snowflake. So we're going to the carnival now, and, uh... The fuck is that? This is not a carnival. This is a horror attraction. You cannot simply attack me. You are now mine forever. You know who the real carnival is? It's me. It's a dude walking around in his underwear. Where am I supposed to go, even? So is this like the fun house? Where there's just a bunch of mirrors everywhere? Except there are no mirrors and this is relatively annoying. Why did I decide to play this? Okay, yeah, so now I know my ABCs about the hooks. Instead of in the actual show, they, they break when you go on top of them. And, and, and instead of you uh, getting thrusted up into the air and then put into a can of tuna. I did a great job. Oh, I just realized it's called a carnival because it's where all the hooks are. And, and Patrick called it a carnival in the episode. How did I miss that? You know, if there was another SpongeBob remake they decided to do, forget about remaking the SpongeBob movie game. Throw that possibility into the dumpster. Then again, throw yourself into that metaphorical dumpster because it's a really dumb idea anyway. They should remake this instead. Look, you, you can still remake the SpongeBob movie game, just just don't have that goofy goober token paywall. Or, or, or make it less of a paywall. Or actually make it fun to collect some of the goofy goober tokens. Because of that alone, be because of how fucking scummy Mindy is, what, what's she gonna do with the goofy goober tokens? Is she gonna go to the arcade? And, 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 and play some shitty games. That's enough reason to open the flying Dutchman's locker and bringing out all of the ghouls and demons to wreak havoc. That dude's about to fall to his death. Nope, nope, he, he, he just glides through the air. I bet Mindy is starting an NFT scam ring. Why are Patrick's shorts so tiny? <laughs> what the heck? Really? Seriously? But seriously, I, I imagine Mindy is the kind of person who would actually cause an NFT scam thing to happen. Guys, I'm being absolutely fucking serious with you. It happened again. Seriously fucking happened again. Doing another mukbang. <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun this time because un unlike with Brilliant Diamond, that was an RPG. But but this, this is a platformer with terrible controls. And the best part is that I have a new mic and this quarter pounder with cheese looks burnt. Oh, I don't consent to this. Well, this. This burger is like fine. You know what I should be doing instead while eating? I should watch like Avatar The Last Airbender or something. And, and nothing bad will come from it. I feel like the only option I have is to turn back. I, I I think I basically did everything I set out to do. I got Patrick's minuscule pants. I don't think I have anything else to gain. Except for this key. Look at that. That's great. You and me? I think, I think we got something in common. I don't know what that is, but there's a spiritual bond between us. All I want is Krabby Patty. <laughs> I can't believe they misspelled it. 